Yep. But those shit, those, those highlights you showed at halftime, Shaq, that's that's the thing he needs to work on. Hey, look oh, there's our guy. Look at that guy. Tan Portland. Hey, I told you, man. I've been to, I've been to, I've been to Portland. Yeah, I love me right some there, Nike, Blake. and I've been to Portland. The sun don't ever shine that much. <laughs> man, I think I know Tan Ken. He looks so familiar, man. Oh. He actually got a little, he's not dark as he was the other night. He, he, <laughs> must be the lighting. Might be the spray tan. Yeah. <laughs> Flash in the pan. Uh, anyway, the other night, uh, we did opening night from Cleveland, and we had the highlights of the Portland game against Utah Jazz. And we had that moment because we saw him in the highlights. Um, and rather than even say anything else, just watch the clip from the other night. Hey, bro. Not there is a big. Bro, impact. get out the sun. Damn. <laughs> that I've been scare. going to Portland for 100 years, and I've never seen the sun that much. Where you can get that. <laughs> really? Ken, what's up, kid? <laughs> Portland can. <laughs> Come on, man. Stay out the, stay out the tanning bed, man. It's not that uh, much space between your nose and your lips. Hey, I'll tell you something. It isn't. Man. Like, uh, ain't no way you can get that tan in Portland, Oregon. Come on. Way. That's impossible. Oh, man. Oh, my Lord. You might see him in the that tanning hurt. bed. You could go get another bracelet. <laughs> <laughs> you know, last year, you get a bracelet like you did last year. Oh, oh man. It, it is good to be back with you guys. It really is, man. Come on, man. So, uh, really, oh, tan, yeah. oh, really tan Portland oh, Ken is actually, oh, hey guys, is actually Ron Sloy. And Ron, thank you, thank you so much for joining us from Portland. Hey, and and look, I, we appreciate. Your sense of humor, <laughs> and we appreciate. Wait, we don't know if he has a sense of humor. No, yeah, yeah, no. Ron's a good sport on that thing. Us out. And that was that was so unexpected. And our guys upstairs did the job with the uh, with the whole paint box thing. But uh, so, what is your story, Ron? We, I know we all he have. Looks good, familiar. We all have good stories, and I know you've said in the paper that you've met the other. You haven't met me, but you've met Shaq and he, Kenny. He's met me. And Chuck. I know he looked familiar. <laughs> <laughs> well, well, fellas, uh, I. I I want to tell you, it's been uh, 15 to 20 years, but I have a private story for each one of you. Uh, Kenny, I'll start with you. I walked into a place with Robert Pack in Denver about 20 years ago, and you were sitting there in a red-brimmed hat, looked like a million bucks, and Robert and I <laughs> sat down with you and uh, enjoyed a cocktail and uh, listened so, to some jazz together, and that was about 15, 20 years ago. I was out there seeing Robert Pack <laughs> with Denver. I, I do then, not uh, remember the red room hat. Uh, <laughs> I do. I, I might remember the jazz because concert. one of uh, your bodyguards, Jerome. Oh yeah, uh, Jerome. Was my best friend for the last 29 years, buddy. And uh, you oh, were so seriously? kind to uh, us in L.A. to the Century Club. Uh, and, that was uh, you. A couple other. We went. To, you took I us up. Him. You took me up to the Forum Club, and uh, I think they actually <laughs> Jerome one uh, night in, in my Jerome. Jerome Kersey went out, and I think they got us spat burgers one night. So yeah. I, I, I thank you. And uh, the best part I can tell you about what you did for me is, you were so kind. You gave me a pair of your shoes, and if I'm not mistaken, they're size 23s. And uh, I took them home to a cancer patient, a, a buddy of mine, and he uh, since passed away. But you couldn't have been any more gracious. And then uh, Chuck, for you. Uh, I'm going to spin you back to Vegas to the NBA lockout, and you and I played golf with Jerome, and, and this is how I'll date you. Jerome pulled up in a limo and rolled his window down and s yelled out the window, hey, big head, and you turned to Jerome and had a couple of words for him, but uh, uh, Chuck, <laughs> let me tell you something. Jerome absolutely loves you, and uh, um, we were hoping that you were going to you were gonna uh, attend uh, his service, but uh, I've been with Jerome many a times, my friend, when you've been on the phone with him, and uh, you couldn't have been any more uh, gracious. Uh, I did spend an evening with you, and I'll, I'll date you with this. Uh, we went to a place called The Drink in Vegas. Do you remember that? I definitely remember The Drink in <laughs> Vegas. We, uh, you know what? Jerome was a great friend. I loved him like a brother. I miss him. Uh, he, he was just a great man. And uh, but, but I tell you what, I've had a lot of fun nights at The Drink in <laughs> Vegas, man. <laughs> Really well, 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 fellas, <laughs> fellas I, I will tell you this. Uh, Jerome right now is so proud. Uh, Kenny, I don't know you like I've met uh, Charles and Shaq, but uh, Jerome had a special uh, attraction to both those guys. He called Shaq big fella, and uh, Charles, I know you guys were like brothers, and uh, I want to tell you how proud I, I'm sure he is and everybody else. You guys give us flat entertainment. And in the last 12 months, what we've been going through with uh, the shootings and the election, uh, this is what it's all about. You guys, uh, you guys were gracious. Uh, I saw how you treated fans back in the day. And Charles, if I'm not mistaken, 
I may be wrong, but I doubt it. Oh, this guy was, you was ready tonight. You was ready tonight. You was getting on TV tonight, boy. I tell you what. Hey, man, we appreciate, you know what, there's so much crazy stuff going on in the world. And we try to make people watch basketball and laugh. We really appreciate you having a good sense of humor, humor with us. Yeah, yeah, Chuck, you guys were special, and I, I appreciate your 15 minutes of fame that you gave me, and uh, hopefully uh, one of these times I'll run into you and give you a big hug. But all, all of you guys were very gracious when I had the, the, the fine opportunity to meet you, and uh, congratulations on uh, TNT, your, your show, and Inside the NBA. And the last thing I want to leave you with, Shaq, I'm surprised you didn't notice this, notice this the other night, but Wiz Khalifa, when you introduced that that was the entertainment, did you notice the DJ, the jersey he was wearing the other night on Tuesday night when you guys were ripping yes, me? I, I, I said yeah, something about it. Yeah, Jerome Kersey jersey. Yeah, no, I, I said, I, yeah, you drunk I, did. I said, yeah. look at the DJ. Yeah. He's got a Jerome Kersey jersey on. I did, yeah. I, 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 this is Charles. I mentioned that. Yeah. So, so guys, what I'll say to you is this wasn't you guys ribbing me. This was Jerome getting his laugh up in heaven saying, <laughs> you know what, my boys, are, my boys are getting Ronnie boy. And so uh, when I saw that jersey, I knew it had nothing to do with you. But uh, thank you very much, and uh, you guys have a, have a wonderful year this year. Hey, Ron, thank you, right, man. Ron. Thanks okay. for coming on. Hey, all right. Are, that was a good cool, sport, man. and you're a good man. We appreciate that you. That was cool, man. Appreciate have a great man. night, man. Take yeah. it easy, Ron. Thanks. That was really cool. Ron, take really care. Tan, that was Ron. really cool, man. Really tan Roy is cool, man. Ron, not Roy. Ron. Ron. Ron Sloan. I'm sorry. Really yeah. tan Ron. Yeah. That was good, though. That it was. was really I really appreciate it. You know, Ernie, you know, part of our job, you know, we see stuff all the time, and we, we got the best job in the world. We play a silly game of basketball. There's so much crazy stuff happening in the world. And, and when you meet somebody, like, we're, we're having fun at his expense, and he can enjoy get a good laugh out oh, of it. It was good stuff. Yeah. And, uh, so we appreciate Ron joining us. Should we move on to the next time? There's a big yeah. financial advisor that somebody's that. telling me that, too. i got to put some money with Ooh, it. Look at the brand-new place out in By 8. Ron Sloy, awesome guy, awesome tan. I like that, man. <laughs> we always win. Thank you, Ron. Yeah, Ron, Ron it, was, it was great of you <laughs> to Yo, join his us. His mustache might have been so perfect. I don't even know. His mustache, his hair. It was like 28. Day. 28 you know what uh, hairs is? on you the know, left you know side, 28 is? hairs on the right yeah. side. That's Dennis Eckersley right there, man. Oh, man. Put the stash back on him. He looks just like the Eck, and he's got the good moss. Oh, okay, oh, Ernie. Yeah. Tan Ernie. Ernie. Yes. Yes. Ernie. I'm just wearing a little bronzer. Ernie yeah. Brunson. <laughs> Look, there's 32 hairs on the right side and 32 hairs on the left. Even amount on each side. That guy is unbelievable. How do you I, know I that? think we hung on that shot long enough. Yeah. When we come back. How do you what, Chuck? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. See, it is. He's Dennis Eckersley, really? man. Oh, wow. Yeah. It is. The perfectly coiffed moss. Uh, D Wade, still wearing number three, but now it says Bulls on the front. We'll be back. Oh.